Hey guys, this is East or the Eastern Cat in Zadar. Welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. So we're here at the top of Mount Carnet, just about to go into Spear Pillar. So between last time and this time, I actually went all the way down the mountain and came all the way back up. Crazy, right? Well, not really. All I did was go down, I ditched a goon who was useless at Beacon, who was dead. And I now have APB, the Meganium that I caught last time with the Master Ball. Look at that glorious spear Master Ball I had. Also, as a fighting type was Swarm, so I have no idea what to do with this thing. Except that it's level 40 and will serve at least as a beat shield. And then I also have Cheese here, who is also a fighting type, which doesn't solve any of my problems for trying to fight flying Pokemon, but now five of my things are weak to flying. But this thing is basically useless right now because it's still a Dratini. Uh, it's got a filter, which is actually pretty good. But its stats are so low that if it takes a super effective hit of any degree, it'll probably still die. And it also has no moves that are any decent for it because it's a fighting type. And also, it's higher physical. These are all actually physical attacks, but it's still a freaking measly Dratini and will do absolutely nothing. So, we're gonna go into Spear Pillar today and hopefully finish the whole distortion world. Um. There is one static Pokemon. Actually, does the Distortion Board have Pokemon? Let me just take a peek at that while we walk up to these people. Hello! How are you? Okay, so Distortion World does not have anything apart from um, Giratina. Uh, When the hell- when the hell is Send Off Spring? Uh, okay, so when you leave the Distortion Board, you end up in Send Off Spring, and that's got a, um, that's got grass in it, so we can catch something there. Alright, what are we doing? A Marsh Top and a Clay Doll. Uh, let's see, I have a Fighting type, so I should probably try and take this- actually, wait, no, no, wait. Where's the Undo- there's no Undo button if you don't use the thing, alright. Fight this thing. And don't stop using your bag. Alright, um... And we shall... Oh yeah, and... My Meganium now has Rock Climb because... The one who had it before died. So... That was a thing. Alright, I did get rid of you. Yes, I get that. It really comes down to it, I can continuously throw potions from one side to the other. To, uh, support. Oh great, it's got rock attacks too! You know what, I think it's Fade All right now is my worst enemy. Like literally, because it can um... It's got some rock attacks, it's got some... Uh, psychic attacks. Because rock will kill bugs, and psychic will kill... Uh, fighting types, and that's basically... Four... Actually, yeah, it's four fifths of my team, because I have an egg on me, because I'm still crazy. Why the hell do I still have an egg on me? I might as well just take in the um... Kept a goon, at least I can fly. Well, at least I try to attack my tank. That's a good start. Maybe. Please don't die. Yeah, kind of one of the people I actually have some trust in. Oh, yeah, if you can hear a little more in the background, I'm sorry, but as far as I can tell, it's not being picked up very much. So hopefully, you can't hear it. And I'd like you to die now. God damn. Alright, hit the, hit the fight out. Yes! It's not very effective, but I will do the job. Alright, so there should be just this double battle, and then there's a multi-battle with Mary. And then we should be into the distortion world, and we should be able to have some fun in there! I have not done that bit, but from what I can tell from the maps, it's like the giant maze of nothing, and I think it's just more like, um... You walk through and Cynthia just talks to you constantly. Is what I understand at least. Um, wow, we have like exactly the same amount of max health. Yeah, I'm just gonna be a bitch right now and heal. I ain't dealing with any casualties when I'm all the way up here. Alright, just heal up. Uh, but, um, 
Yeah, so you kind of just follow Cynthia around. There's a bit of puzzles to like get through. Why do they all have ancient power? And then you just get to the end. Holy shit! All right, we need um someone else out here. Uh, Mighty Water is a water attack. All right, screw this noise. Santa's X is coming out to play. Stop using the bag. Alright, um... Are you still confused? Actually, why do I have this? I can't even use this. What do I cover with rock climb? Oh yeah, I covered that. What is it? Sweet... Oh, sweet spore? Oh, no. Sweet sin! Why do I keep on the spore? That's really weird. Okay, the lawnmower is going crazy outside. I don't know what the hell they just hit. What do you need in the distortion? I need strength, which is fine. Uh, strength and this water, so you need surf. Is there anything in the water? I wonder if I can fish anything out of the water, that would be kind of funny. Uh, yeah, let's try and get rid of all of our whoever this person is. So wait, did I hit myself? I'll probably hit myself. Didn't I? Oh, Pro Ted, you think you're so cute. You're a bitch! Okay, so, um, this is the double dash one. Uh, what I was I like, doing? Oh, come on, you can't quite take that many times. And actually attack this time rather than smacking yourself. Are you serious? Uh, it's gonna be one of these people. Hello, Don, and a protector self, of course. Ow. Can you kill yourself now? Alright, we are using some more hyper potions because they're being a bitch. How many more pedal dances do I have? That's a real question right now. Um, you know what? We're just gonna use rock one, screw it. I know it's weaker because um, the game is high on the. Uh, Special attack, but I'm not dealing with a stupid protect. Okay, fine, I'm dealing with a stupid protect. Great, I gotta identify. I don't know what that's supposed to do to me, but okay. Go and protect again. Actually, how many protects does I still have? It worked, kind of. Actually, make sure you use Glory, yes. Right. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for that marshal to kill itself. So we're gonna focus fire over here. Actually, there's 20 pedal dots. Imagine just keep spamming this. Alright, whoever this is heading is gonna die. So you are dead, sir. It's super effective, I forgot about that. I wonder if it's actually a water brown type. Probably not. Holy shit, the EXP got spread like crazy. 39. I also should check when, um. What level is Dragon here. So that's kind of important. Alright, you're not a threat. Kill that almost star. Get the hell out of here with your project. Alright, you're dead. Thank you. That makes me fundamentally less angry. Yeah, you're not a fritter. You're not a fritter at all, are you? Okay, shoot the flow from critical hits. Confused, doesn't matter. I am going to hit you in the face, it's going to hurt you a lot, and I'm going to be satisfied. Right there, that was a lot easier than the start of the fight.
Okay, so... Oh, level 40. Never mind, we got a dragon here. Fundamentally stronger. And also slightly more useful. At least I'm not a baby anymore, but that's basically what Dratini is. Good cheese evolved into Dragonair. That is great. My cheese. Alright, so what do your stats look like now? Are they serviceable? Kind of. And your skill or your ability changed to Aftermath. Wait, what was it? It was before it was the. Wait, are you still fighting, dude? You're still fighting, but your ability changed to Aftermath. Okay, so if I need to sacrifice someone, you're it! Congratulations! Alright, so I am actually going to switch your held item, since you're now at least somewhat serviceable, to my lucky egg and see if I can get you up to a Dragon Knight anytime soon. Probably not, because that takes forever, I think it's 55 before it evolves again. Actually wait, what level does? I thought that was way too early. 39. Yeah, that feels way too early. Okay, I'm gonna see what you can do at the front. You'll probably die, but well, whatever at this point. Hello! It's not like we have a 202 battle. Alright, so what level are they? Let's have a look here. 44, 44, 46, 44, 44, 46. Well, wonderful. I'll be good. Alright, Barry, carry. Well, actually, no, I don't think you need Barry to carry me. I don't know if Barry can carry me. He's got a freaking level 44 either. Um, uh, one problem with you, you have actually no moves. But. The Pucciana would not be a threat, and if the Layer will stop being a bitch, I could probably kill it. Alright, appreciate it, probably did. You do not survive a fire blast when it's super effective you in the face. Baltoy. That may be a problem, but I need to kill it first. Switching targets. Oh great, it's also level warning. Alright, you must die first when I'm fighting time. I like how we have the same idea. Alright, Barry, carry me! <laughs> He is carrying the heck out of me right now. Who is it? I think that's um... I can't count that who that is. This is Mars on that side. Eat an Aquatail and drop in. Shit. Yeah, attack Barry. Don't attack me. That's fine. Barry has six Pokemon. It's okay. Is this gonna kill the Baltoid? I might kill the battle. Oh, well, sucks to be you. Okay, so behind this Bonita, here's a Rapid Dash. Good job, Randomizer. And it's a Voltorb. Alright, so you have to die before you explode. So I'm just gonna start attacking you. That did not hurt Rapid Dash very much. Oh, someone's gonna die. You, sir, I probably did. You, sir, I definitely did. What level does Ponita learn Fire Blast? Actually, no, what level does Rapid Dash learn Fire Blast? You learn this later when you're involved. Attack him. No, don't attack me. I'm not scary. Okay, and I'm dead. Well, shit. Oh, that didn't last long. You see, that's not what happens if I use anyone, like, at the name of anyone I know, they'll instantly die. It's pretty much happened consistently. Actually, no, well, only two, two of the people I've known that have lasted more than, like, two or three, um, episodes, so, you know. That's kind of, I was kind of expected, I didn't actually expect to keep all the way up to a Dragon Knight. Um, Alright, actually, what level is Giratina? Let me have a look at that. But well, that's probably what's more 
recorded. You know, I was trying to fight Cyrus and Sino. Oh, that would be interesting. So, Sino will fight Cyrus in the distortion one. He goes up to 48. That could be bad. But the Maya might just not work. Alright, Barry, carry me. Um. You know, that's the point in the game when I really want to start after. You know, yeah, I might like looking at Cyrus's team in the regular, uh, just regular game, and a Staraptor would make me a lot happier. A Staraptor in general makes me a lot happier because it's really strong for really early Pokemon, but... Anyways, we're gonna work our way through these idiots. But the only thing I can say is that if, um... If I can somewhat make it through Cyrus, there's a level 47 thing waiting for me, because Giratina is 47. No idea what it's gonna be, but Giratina is 47, so... It'll be something. Hopefully, mildly useful. I feel like I've been missing this thing like a complete moron. Alright, I can't miss the blue, let's take that. It's a goddamn grass type. That's why Fire Blast is strong against it. I don't know why we're looking at how to catch uh, where, the thing where Garatina is before I even got there. Uh, quick attack. Why are you using agility? Attack it! Kill him! Kill him! Be helpful, partner! You must carry me! Because I'm freaking useless! And the left over doesn't actually heal me. I think I only heal as much as I hit what hurts me for. Or maybe heal a little bit more, I can't tell. Well, that works. You should have done that a bit earlier. Okay, you have no physical damage, apparently. Despite having a hold on your head, physical damage does not mean anything. Alright, one more. I like there's no wanting to stop about now as well. Oh, my star! Wait, that's your second one! Really? Screw you two! Alright, I'm gonna just seal up. Is you really fury attack? Ah, we're doing this again. Oh, no, no, wait, the old Mistal wasn't be on previous battle. Okay! I am getting the hell out of dodge! Does almost not have- Wait, what ancient power? Is that special or physical? What ancient power is physical? Is it special? If it's special, that explains why it's doing so much damage. Um, alright, we need, uh, Santa's X, because you're the only person that can eat any form of rock attack. Actually, no, um... Uh, it rock attacks! Wait, is fighting actually resistant against rock attacks, or is it just, um, regular damage? Can you just press out Fury Attack and do something, like, slightly stronger? Oh, never mind, you're dead. Next. Barry, carry me. He's got a coughing. Fantastic. Go poison him, please. Ah. We're doing this again. Oh my god. Don't be a bitch. I have enough hyper potions to outlast the hail if it doesn't stop. Ah, uh, you 
on, helpful, three more damage, please. That's nearly dead. We can even outlast the hail if we really felt like it. He just runs off. Why well, aren't you helpful? The epicness begins, even though it's kind of not that epic. So, uh, you know what, since I want to do the whole of, um, Distortion World within this video, I'm gonna cut here and I'm gonna walk through the whole Distortion World off camera, because it's honestly, apart from uh, a bit of story and stuff, there's not actually anything interesting to see in there. Well, there is, um, I'll make sure to bring you guys back in, but otherwise, I'm just gonna go all the way over to Cyrus, and then we'll start the battle with him, and then we'll fight the thing where Giratina is, and then... That will be this video because walking through a blue world is probably not very interesting when there's nothing happening. So anyways, um, I shall be right back. Alright, we make it, to the, make it to the bottom. I, as much as it probably would have been amusing watching me wrap my head around how to get down here. We cut all that bed out and I'm not doing that again so that's why I saved. Alright, so you are dead, so we need to take this off you, and we're down to effectively four Pokemon, and hopefully the randomites and misses will um, Cyrus a decent bit so I can actually clear this. Um, and then they just have the giant argument, and then you go up and just like. That or me. And then we can finally get to the next part. So this guy's five Pokemon, they're all high level in the stuff I have. It may end up Alright, well not in so poorly, but it has a flying Pokemon and like I said before, there's a serious problem when it has a flying flying Pokemon, because I have absolutely nothing that can resist it apart from one thing that should now carry me through this. Of course it drew a picture into the face. I was kind of expecting that, but um, hopefully we can clear out the rest of this thing. This is 45. This is weakest thing, right from the front. You know his team in the regular game is like almost entirely dark, which is kind of interesting. Well, three fifths dark, not quite entirely. Help but more close to four fifths. The Dragonair. Well, I know that you're a fighting type, but that doesn't help me. Um, you will, you will have Aqua, probably Aqua Tail and Dragon Rush. Don't know you still a slam, and I don't know what your other move was. I can't remember what that was. All right, you're going out. You know, I said that I was going to send Jeez out to be my sacrifice. I don't think he ever actually managed to, um, die from the hail, so the aftermath doesn't actually do anything. That's awkward. Uh, you have the Dragon Rush. Kind of expecting that. Probably should have light screen in front of my face. You know, I don't think that will protect me against physical attacks, which is what Dragonair apparently has the most of. 
Well, that's gonna be a problem. Oh, that's gonna be an incredible problem. Does this thing still have Zen Hitbot? That is the real question. It still has Zen Hitbot, but I miss. Right. <sighs> what the hell was Taurus other typing? Uh, well, either way, um, we're gonna try and absorb the psychic attacks here. Hey, you wanna play the switching game? I can play it with you, even though I'm fundamentally weaker. I think I felt like I said fundamentally a lot today. I don't know why, it's just a word that came through. Alright, we're gonna bite you! Wait, they're just swagger me. Alright, still better. Good. I don't think Taurus was the sturdiest thing in the world, and also my physical attack is shot up from Swagger, so... This thing should die in... I put Jiffy as long as I don't hit myself in the face. Alright, fine. No, won't die quite as fast as I wanted it to. Please tell me this is only full restore. We can slowly work this thing down. That recoil did not do much damage. And I think at this point I'm allowed to be really passive and just keep healing. If I can bite it one more time, it's down. That's also his highest level thing, so he threw out. Uh, his 47 was the. Uh, the. What was it again? Oh, this is his strongest thing. The thing he threw out before was his second strongest, so he should only be left with that 47 and 246s now. Munchlax, alright, I don't feel particularly threatened by that thing. There should be one of the 46s. Uh, yeah, let's light screen up. Just as a precaution. Doesn't help. But luckily it's a baby Pokemon, so it doesn't hit me as hard as it probably should. Oh great, and now I'm locked into Biddle Dance. Please don't kill me. I should be fatigued right now, right? Alright, apparently it can last more than three turns, I didn't know that. Well, I'm dead. Casualty number two of the day. And that's also the second person I've named something after that's died instantly. Well then. Back to the same team. And yes, I know I'm not very careful. Alright, so my memory, at least Snorlax is high on physical attack and yeah, just tons of health and actually has Relatively poor physical defense, I think. I think it has a lot of special defense, but physical defense in my memory was actually kind of poor. Not like a chancy level poor, but um, not that sturdy. And we can work it down. Uh, oh, dragon, yeah, that was good. Um, I don't think you're strong enough to blow me up, so I'm going to... Yes. 
slash you. How do Oh wait wait wait. Does this thing have aftermath? Why would it aftermath? Does this thing have aftermath? I feel like the ability changes really randomly. It's hard to determine what actually has. Alright, let's be a bit more careful around this thing, because it might aftermath be to death. You know that also make it my fourth, I think, casualty from aftermath that actually happened? That is just four sword, alright. Hopefully it doesn't happen anymore. Safe cut all you want, I'm gonna slash you till you're dead. So after this, he should just have one more 46. Hopefully it's not something crazy. Actually, the bank hasn't thrown out yet. I feel like it's not something crazy. Okay, crit it. Alright, it's gonna hit me off the map. It did hit me off the map, but he's gonna pull it up. Okay, I don't know what the throw can do. Pull it on. It's all mostly water attack. That's the stuff I usually have. Alright. I have no good strategy against this thing. Let's see what typing it is. Also, I can't freeze it right now. I don't know why I'm ice fanning before surfing. Ice fang. It worked. Well, that is great for me. Ice fang again, dude. I missed. I spank the game dude. And goodbye. Santa 6 carrying my ass. Yeah, yeah, I keep dreaming. And he just leaves. And I got healed, alright. So we're just gonna end off with this. Great meeting. Um... So, um, you're dead. That didn't last long. Also, the focus band didn't work, so that kind of pisses me off. Alright, so back down to free. But we can catch this thing and then catch something at, um, the next place, which is, what was it? Sinal Spring. And then if we really wanted to, we can try and catch the Lake Guardians, which... Do they actually sit inside the cave, or they don't want to run around like a bunch of crazy assholes? Alright, I think they actually sit around inside. So we can go after those as well. They're level 50, so that might be a good idea. Now, uh, where are we going? Okay, is it here now? Alright, we're at the end of the passage. Here comes the glorious Giratina. Who's quietly looking at me. Rawr! Right. You are... Actually a Giratina. Alright. I have no idea what to do now. I actually don't know what to do now. Um... What can I do? Dragon Claw, Omnius, Sword, Ancient Power, Shadow. I can Ancient Power! Shit. Um... Alright. We... We can't... Have... 
I bought that now at least until all the ancient power Let me just check how much PP ancient power has. But that might become a problem. Ancient power has 5. So the woman, 5 ancient powers come out, we're actually safe. Uh, also what type thing is this normally? Ghost Dragon, hopefully it's not actually Ghost Dragon. What was that? Shadow, is that Shadow Force? Let me just check what Shadow Force does. I am abusing the wolf like a crazy asshole right now. Um, vanish and then reappear. But it's a ghost attack, so um, I don't get affected by it because I'm a normal type Volrin. What do you know? It actually helps. Can I squeeze one more in there? Oh jeez, it's like the superior like crazy. If I kill it, well, you can actually catch it again later, so that's not really a problem. Hey, what do you know? Alright, we're gonna try and catch it. Let's have some fun. Dust ball. Actually, I don't know why I didn't throw a um, quick ball right in its face. I also don't know if I should just um, sand attack it or it's like basically got no um, accuracy in it. Um. Alright. Do I actually have anything that could status a woman? I don't. I have a serious lack of status moves. Also, I just decided to go to sleep in front of it. Which is kind of ironic. Alright, so we'll be throwing balls at this thing for a while here. I'm actually not expecting to catch it. Uh, I'm thinking probably we'll be trying for this again later. Where Giratina supposedly is more defensive at that time. I'm actually more surprised this thing's actually. Because, um, um, like, Rotom was different. So I just presume Giratina would also be changed. Or, um, these Pokemon not affected by a randomizer. Also, should probably turn this game down a little bit because it's really loud right now. Um, okay, so we have about, like, 50 more uh, Dust Balls. So this is. Gonna be a glorious gameplay of me throwing dust balls at this thing, and then I think I have about 20 timer balls as well. So that'll be another 20 timer balls thrown at this thing's headed. Also, what's its catch rate? 3. So 0.4% when using a Pokeball at full health, then I don't know how to calculate catch rate, so I don't know how much catch rate I'm currently at, because supposedly, uh, dust balls when used in the current condition are more effective than, uh, Ultra Balls? So, that's a thing. Uh, so, there's Ultra Balls and Time Balls, and I really feel like I could throw my Master Ball, even though I don't want to at this point. Okay, that's one Ancient Power. One that orders Ancient Powers out, I can actually switch Pokemon to see. Well, the main thing will be to send attack it in the face till it's like on the accuracy there. Actually, that's not a good idea, because I did get rid of all the ghost attacks before I could send uh, uh, those out, because my Leaf Beyond is like, go is like a psychic and uh, bug. So I can't eat rock attacks, I can't eat uh, ghost attacks. Why oh, isn't this exciting? Um, okay, it's hurting me a lot right now. We need a potion. You know, at some point I really need to check my randomizer again just to see what it actually um, set up. Because uh, at this point I'm reaching a point where I don't actually know what's happening. Uh, Alright, more task balls. I have fun of these. Keep breaking out. 
I'm probably gonna buy some new balls once I'm out of here. Probably, yeah. Alright, so there's 15 Dragon Balls. I think that's about 4. Also, I need to get heal again. That was good. I should probably just use the mouse from this. Probably easier. I'm not exactly using the D-pad for anything like that. Alright, I have two Ancient Powers. I don't know how that helps me because, um, that only helps Mr. Rockin on Bot 9. Yeah, this was faster if I just use a touch pad here. Hey, Shook! What a surprise! Okay, that's three Ancient Powers? I'm also still asleep, which I find hilarious. Look at this exciting gameplay. You know, to be honest, whenever I play normally, I just prepare about like 100 Pokeballs and fully YOLO mode catching legendaries, so I'm probably actually more prepared with just 20 Dust Balls and Hyper Balls than I am with 100 Pokeballs, which by the way is freaking impossible. I usually have to restart the game like 3 or 4 times, or probably more than that, to just catch a legendary. Especially these um, in game ones, which are. Lower in catch rate than like the more was it pseudo legendaries. So uh, without the seven dust balls, I like how the end of the video is just gonna be me throwing balls at freaking Pokemon. It's also not shaking as well, which is really worrying. Um, I'm basically going to start struggling because once it starts struggling, it's probably gonna kill itself on me unless I can. Somehow get rid of all its ghosts and um, rock attack. Well, once it starts struggling, those are gone. But I don't know if I can actually uh, ten attack it enough times in the face to like drop its accuracy down to like the point where it can't hit me or struggle, so I can't recoil myself either. Uh, has it been enough turns when you start throwing climbing balls? I don't actually know. Well, it will be by the time another one. Such intense gameplay! It doesn't even shake. I don't know why I'm trying. I mean, it'd be nice to have this thing since it's got amp stats and everything. Also, I was wasting all of my potions. Not like that matters, I have so much money right now. No idea. There is like a bit here, was it? Unlike previous Pokemon games, legendaries respawn each time you clear the Elite Four. So we're not really in any pressure to try and catch this thing. Since it does appear again later as a static thing, which I'm counting as um, a one of a kind for itself, for own area. Uh, I think it's just not throwing time of balls at it. Actually, I don't know if time balls are actually more effective than dust ball in this condition. Where are my timers? I only have 10 of these. I shook. But not any more effective than the last one. Okay, and I'm really hurting right now. Don't you love it when I have so many energy roots that you can't burn through my health? At this point I've actually run out of things to say, so I'm just like kind of watching the balls fly in. Uh, not the ball. Wait, what? Okay, I caught the Garatina. It's only a dark type. Okay, so it's a it's typing got randomized, and um, it's 
I suppose there's an ability bar that I randomize as well. Well, for the occasion, well, we're just gonna call you not. Uh, give me a space in here. Uh, R. Where's it in? In. Where the hell is it? In. G. Uh, we'll put a apostrophe here and put a D here because you think it's changed by a randomizer. Congratulations! But you're a part of our team now, and I'm gonna abuse the heck out of you. Hi. Cool. All right. So, uh, we're going to get out of here, and we'll end up inside Cinder Spring. And I think that's where we'll start off from next time. So, I guess that was a success, even though I sacrificed the two things I immediately I caught from last time. Also wasted a Master Ball from last time, technically, because, um... Hey, where's that guy going? Uh... Yeah, I wasted my Master Ball, technically, because, um... My Meganium instantly died. Well, not as fast as my Dratini, which evolved into a Dragonair, which is wonderful. You know, instantly died and is no longer usable. But, um... Can I leave now? Yeah, let's leap into the bottle! So anyways, that will be it for this episode of Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. I have no idea where we're going next time because I haven't, I haven't looked that far into the walkthrough because that's how I work out where I'm going now because I haven't played this part of the game. But anyways, if you want to follow this series, remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching and until next time.